The dog that mauled a Madison Township woman who, to death earlier this week was euthanized today. And today was a busy day for the Butler County Dog Warden with at least three calls dealing with vicious dogs. Local 12's Larry Davis is live in Hamilton with a look at what you should do if you find yourself face to face with a dangerous animal. Hi, Larry. Hi, Rob. We're here at the Animal Friends Humane Society where that dog pit bull was uh, euthanized this afternoon. Now, it is a very scary situation when you come face to face with a vicious dog, but there are some do's and don'ts you should follow when you find yourself being attacked. Deputies say the dog that was euthanized today was responsible for the mulling death of a Madison Township woman. Yesterday, a pit bull was shot when police say it attacked a Middletown police officer. In June, a six-year-old Westwood girl was seriously injured when mauled by a pit bull. Earlier today, the Butler County Dog Warden says a woman was bitten by this pit bull on South 2nd Street in Hamilton. She was taken to the hospital. Dog Warden Supervisor Kurt Merb says there are steps to take if you spot a dog that appears to be aggressive. The best thing to do is to just cross the street if you can, to avoid it altogether. Um, if you don't have to go that way, turn around and come back the way you were coming. Just avoid the situation altogether, especially if you notice that dog's not on a leash. Merb says by ticking off and running may heighten the senses of the dog. Don't do anything quick. Um, a lot of times it's, it's good to just kind of slowly bring your hands up so that they're not just dangling down at the side. You know, just kind of slowly bring them up, maybe rest them on your hip. And one thing you can use to defend yourself against an attacking dog is an umbrella, if you have one handy. For one, you can fight one off with it. And two, by opening it, you can scare it off. Merb says when attacked by an aggressive dog, you must defend yourself by staying on your feet. You try kicking it to keep it off of you, do anything, keep pushing. Um, the one thing you absolutely do not want to do is go to the ground. And if you go to the ground, if the dog's strong enough and it knocks you over, try to get back up. And Rob, uh, Merb says that by staying on the ground, you're actually exposing your entire body to that attacking, attacking dog, especially the neck area. Now, he also says make sure you yell or scream so that someone knows you're in trouble. Live in Hamilton, Larry Davis, Local 12 News. Rob, back to you. Larry, great advice, but as you know, easier said than done, don't you think? I mean, your instinct Easy. is just a rabbit. Get out of there. It really is, and, and sometimes it's uh, it, sometimes it's too late to, to react because that uh, you, you could be attacked in, in a matter of a you know split second. Yeah, true, Larry. Thanks very much. The woman bitten today by the pit bull in Hamilton is out of the hospital. The dog warden says charges are pending, but nobody claims to own the dog.